Hey guys, Sackbutt Ninja 3 here, and today I am back with part 2 of the World Box story. So, this is where we left off at. First, I'm just going to go around and look at how things are been, have been going. I'm going to put on times 5 first. So, they got some nice cities. Over here was definitely destroyed. And orcs seem to be going there because they all can, well, kind of get to each other faster. What the heck's going on here? Okay, then. They got some nice civilizations. Let's see which one has the most population. Zero. Didn't that one have like 20 something at one point? So 15 is still the highest. Alright. Just gonna have an earthquake over here. There we go. Connected to that now. And this over here. Hold up. Just gotta get that green grass. Alright. So right now, there's not really any wars going on. But I see that they are traveling across to other places as well. So, we need to get more of their population up. And there's human explorers that are going to travel down here. Maybe not. Why do they always go up there? Come on. There we go. The explorers found the dwarves area, and now they know that the dwarves exist because they didn't before. Or did they? I don't think they did, so we'll just go with that. I can't remember what was the last thing they invented. I think they only invented these three. All right, so just a lot of rebuilding of their civilizations after that one war. It's kind of over. Just no one's really fighting anymore. But races still don't like each other. Which, by the way, they should update it where you can choose if they're going to like each other or not. Then, oh, they got some city going on here. There needs to be more elves. Looks like they're trying to attack them. And the battle begins. They're going to lose. The dwarves keep bringing in more people, so who knows? I don't know if I should bring in the aliens or not and have it where they want to take over the planet separately. We'll not have these ones, we'll just have the cold ones. So aliens appeared here in a group. They seem to be doing good. A lot of stuff is getting frozen up there. The ice is going to return. Oh, 
Also, there was a meteor landed right there. Does anyone even live over here? Oh yeah, the elves do. Just some rain clouds. They seem to defeat their cold ones. All right. Over time, some more land was formed here. And I guess this is what it turns into. building room right there and the humans went over here to, oh they're starting to rebuild over here decided to actually I don't see what's going on the humans are building like all over this area so let's wait and see Oh, they're going to start a battle on their own. Oh, uh, yeah, the orcs are bringing in people, like troops, on their own. But I'm going to spawn in more. They're just here to take over this territory. So then the humans. Okay, never mind, there's a battle still going on. Seems you guys want me to do humans versus orcs, so that's what I'm mostly going to be doing here. Anyways, these humans are going to try and ravage their city. And they used acid. I'm just going to say they used gas. On all their stuff. And started dissolving the land. mess what the orcs land turned into after they use the acid. And now we're going to go over to the other orc base. They got hangry and so they traveled over here and brought a ton of orcs to rebuild first of all. This whole base here, this human city, is going to be ravaged by the orcs. But too many orcs kept coming, so they decided we're just going to have to do this. So the humans placed landmines all over this until one of them stepped on it. It's not enough. Alright, the landmines blew up part of the bridge. They still can contact each other, so they need to place more. Okay, I'm just trying to separate the contact. 
So they broke up that bridge right there so that they can't, the orcs can't get over to them. Unless they use boat. But they wanted to get rid of that way. Now these humans are isolated over here. Soon to be taken down by the orcs. So the orcs started a fire. Let's hope it works. Or at least they hope. Doesn't seem the fire is doing too good. But the orcs tried. Also a tornado over here. An earthquake right here. And right here, just to connect everything. All right. I'm going to go and connect these. There we go. Now the elves and orcs are having a little battle over here. Since so the elves are trying to rebuild, I assume the elves are going to build out here. this land is supposedly going to be taken over by the orcs. All right. And seems this whole human city was taken down by the orcs and the elves decided to cross over somehow. Anyway, the elves are going to try to get rid of the orcs. So they brought in a huge mass number of elves. Seems to be working, I guess. There could be other battles going on that I can't see. Anyways, let's see here. This whole area. Yep, they're starting to claim territory down here. Alright, so it seems that the elves are trying to build trees and conquer land while the orcs are re rebuilding camp over here. Long lasting battle for territory up here. Well, the elves already claimed this territory down here. They keep sending in more people while the orcs are going down here. Oh, seems the orcs have claimed some territory here as well. And, uh, yes, they're building a lot of trees all over. These orcs cannot lose more because they, I mean, they do have cities up here. The humans don't even know exist. They did, they'd probably already destroy it. Just a second. All right, so the elves are just building a lot more trees over in this section. And the closer they get their trees, the more territory they're gonna own. That's weird, that looks like a house all by itself. The orcs are just kind of rebuilding over here. But they're still having a battle for territory. And they're also rebuilding down here. 
Seems the elves have destroyed their camp. They're building a lot along here. So now the elves and the orcs, I guess, are having a battle. Building a lot of trees. Is that one of those big trees? Yep. Now they got one of those big trees. Seems a little unfinished. But, I mean, I don't know. Alright, the, um, the orc city is a little bit destroyed again. Most of the stuff they already rebuilt. Seems they're building right here, all in this area. The orcs are just building. I destroyed all the old human stuff. All the elves still trying to get territory up here. Which I think they already technically have won. Seems this giant tree they built here was destroyed by the orcs but they are building a lot all they need to do is get rid of that so the orcs got TNT and threw TNT all in here the elves don't have any explosives. As long as they don't light it up. Oh, well, that's kind of hard because. Yeah. So they set fire to the forest to burn down all of the trees and blow up the TNT. And I guess that kind of backfired on them as well. But it'll rebuild. Looks like not much contact can get to them now. Seems orcs are trying to build in their territory while the elves are trying to get more. Besides all this territory they have done here. Now let's check up on the dwarves. The dwarves have a lot of territory here. Over here they kind of do, it seems that they've kind of been having a battle that we didn't watch. Between the orcs and the human, no, the dwarves and the humans, it's still going on. Seems the humans have kind of built here. It's of the dwarves, and they've kind of just been destroying it. And this looks destroyed already, but they're rebuilding it. So there's a giant territorial war. This one we missed down here, the one up there we've been watching. But I think the one up there is over for now. I think the humans are glad to be done with the orcs. So, they invented the missile. How about the... No. I don't know. The humans invented the missile. I know it's just called the palm, but I call it the missile. But they haven't used it yet. And they wanted to test one. It went too far than expected. And landed here. They didn't know if it works or not. Probably did, no. And since it's explosives, they expected it to be the orcs. So the elves sent in a ton of troops into the orc base. Come on. 
Why are they all heading back? Seriously. There we go. Sent in a lot of elves. Now they're going to try to claim territory here. I don't know if the elves and humans know each other exist or not yet. All this elf, or no, all this dwarf building seem to be already destroyed. It seems the dwarves are kind of attacking the elves as well. So now the elves are both attacking them. There's still a territorial war going on here. I can see that the humans are rebuilding. But the dwarves are definitely going to attack again. I don't want to miss that one. But I got to go back up here to resume the battle. As soon as they build at least one tree. They're bound to build a ton. Oh, never mind, they already did. <sighs> Sucks for those orcs because now there's going to be trees everywhere. Let's see what's going on. Oh, they just sent in a lot of troops. And are destroying the buildings. That the humans just made. It seems the ones they already built too are still being destroyed. Dang. There's a giant battle going on here. So, since the dwarves had territory on both ends and they want to keep this area. They decided, and everyone has explosives now, through trade and copying stuff, to place landmines for the humans. So the next time those humans want to come down here, that's going to explode. There's humans down here right now, but as soon as, as long as they don't repopulate, because they keep populating. Oh no. I missed that. The whole battle over here. Humans ravaged their city. And that was just blown up. And over here. Seems there's still a battle going on. More elves are claiming territory here. Building trees along this area. So, I think the elves own that area now. And they decided to launch this, these missiles all the way down here. And, yeah. Over time, the humans blew that up. And also, There was fire set right here. A lot of fire, actually. They wanted to burn it all. It doesn't seem that their fire worked, though. It did over here, but their plan to get the whole area didn't seem to work. Well, over here, the elves have built a lot. There's no one living up here anymore. Those elves might get their territory now. 
They got all this. Most of this was ravaged by the dwarves. <sighs> a lot. I'm surprised they haven't built down here yet, especially since they want a lot of territory. I can't tell. I think the elves have the second most territory. Got this whole area. And then the elves make an alliance with the humans. But the orcs and the dwarves are not working together. And so basically, since the elves are fighting against both nations, or species, the humans are now going to have to fight the orcs as well. Just waiting for them to build more. There's enough room for you to build a tree here. Like, come on. They just want to go to the main area. Okay, then. Just got to water some of this up. Then, the humans sent in an air force to the dwarf base. Oh. I did not think that through at all. It also blows up all this stuff over here. Oh, okay. Hmm. No time to blow all this up. I can always zap them with electricity before they get too far. Oh, whatever. They're going to blow all that up anyways. And this is what the world looks like. So, thanks for watching part two. I'll be making part three tomorrow, hopefully. If not, I'll try to do it as soon as possible. That's going to be my next world box video, unless there's a new update. So, thanks for watching, and bye. Thank <laughs> you.